The car industry has gone through a lot of changes. Robots are replacing workers on the assembly line. And it isn't just cars and lorries coming out of factories anymore, because the people carrier is becoming more and more popular. In this factory, we witness the birth of an MPV. The first step is to put together the front structure. It's made up of the radiator support, two side rails and clips on the front for the bumper structure. The front structure is placed on the automated production line. Meanwhile, robots weld what's known as the ladder assembly. It's the backbone that supports the floor and sides of the vehicle and contain, among other things, the pockets that will hold the seats. Next, the robots descend upon the front end structure and the ladder assembly to weld them together. Elsewhere, the vehicle's body panel is being worked on. The entire panel is made of one piece of galvanized steel. The robots weld reinforcements onto the panel so that interior components can be attached at a later stage. A transfer device swoops down to hurry the panel along to the next station. The vehicle's opposite body panel has arrived too. In another part of the plant, the underbody and floor panel have been welded to the ladder assembly unit we saw earlier. Now the robots get to work and attach the side panels to the underbody structure. They also weld inner wheel wells to the body side panels. The roof is added. The vehicle rolls forward to its next destination. Here the bonnet and doors are assembled. An inspector checks the gaps around the bonnet looking for dents in the body and make sure the doors are flush with the side panels. He marks any areas that need repair or adjustment with removable ink. The engines arrive at the plant already assembled. Workers just need to install and adjust a few components. Meanwhile the vehicle is getting a paint job and having glass, handles and interior components installed. In the chassis department, the engine, transmission, rear suspension and brake assembly are installed from underneath, using a two-tier assembly line. The machines that install the components have long pins that fit into holes in the vehicle's underbody. This positions the components with precision. Workers hook up the petrol tank manually. The seats arrive ready-made from a nearby factory. They simply clamp into place in the seat pockets that were welded onto the ladder assembly earlier. The tyre is mated to the wheel rim. This automated machine then inflates and balances the tyre in one. For the first time, the vehicle comes off the assembly line and sits full weight on its wheels. Workers start up the ignition and run the vehicle through a series of tests. It's taken this plant just 24 hours to produce this vehicle, which will soon be on its way to a car dealership. Don't forget to haggle. <laughs>